tell me about your spirits experience, Pharrell. Uh, I burned myself whenever I was seven, mm -hmm. and I died twice on the way to the hospital, and if you don't believe that, I didn't burn myself. It's on my stomach and on my legs and shit. You know that. My scar. Um, men all take my scars. Men all take my scars. Take a scar. You know what I mean? From the craft. <laughs> and whenever I did die, and the hospital resuscitated me, mm -hmm. I seen heaven and I seen hell. What? I didn't know that even existed. Even all the spirits I've seen, angels, Jesus, angels, and demons. No. I seen myself at the gates of heaven, and then God fucking dropped me to hell and catched me before I even fell. And that's true. Like, if no one believes in heaven or hell or God or the devil, believe it. I never it's met the true. devil. I never met the devil, but I met demons. And I met angels' wings, and I met Jesus. The demon, I mean, the uh, spirits are here that are on earth or in limbo. They still have shit that they have to do out here. But, or, yes. Or um, they're around you, or they're long distance. That's how I've seen them. Um, I'm so experienced. <laughs> <laughs> but your experience is... What, complete total what 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 about the devil you seen it or you sensed it no god allowed me to see that that is where i'm gonna be if i don't change my ways <laughs> and in life. what the fuck are you supposed to change no answers no, no fucking knows. answers nope there's never answers i mean you're still part of the light so you do as best you can so the light will come and protect you is what i've seen and there's demons that are um dark energies and they're just polluting you and they've got a headache you gotta keep your distance and it's like a duh, and the and sometimes Jesus won't even come, and sometimes he will, and cast away with his beautiful, fucking unconditional loving, what? psychedelic, acidy uh, presence of the light that feels good and makes you feel like you're an acid. Really, and then that's like heaven there, just to be in the presence of Jesus and being loved by him. That's heaven, and then outside of that, it's kind of like the void or the empty space, or around us, we make our own little heavenly balls of light. Sure. Other than that's what I think is what I experience. But, yeah, I've seen it. What was the demon? Because there's gel in there. That's hell. Kind of no, people bully each other. With you them. don't see demons. They're just... No, I've seen those. No, no, no. I, I believe you, what you've seen. But what yeah. i seen when I had my life experience in hell, hard. it's all dark in it. It's yeah, hot. Yeah, there you go. Oh, it's it, hot. It's very hot. And you feel the flames. I, like, That's you know, interesting. Because a lot of people who talk about that are talking about it's burning in hell and all it's smelling like shit and all that bullshit. Right? Yeah, rotting. I mean, rotting. It, yeah, I mean, it's hell. It's whatever you're, uh, you fear the most. Oh, God. And I fear snakes and spiders, and I believe <laughs> that I'm going to fucking perish and be tormented by snakes and spiders. Like, I've seen that, and it's real. If you don't know and believe it, I'm, I'm listening. But then it's so, real. But you don't know why the hell they would show you that place where you might have done wrong? Mm -hmm. Like, what would be so wrong about what you're doing? I don't know, honestly. Being boring and not doing anything. And you're just fucking seven. I was just seven. I was supposed to warn you before you go out and be a super hurtful person. <laughs> mm. What could be the fucking hell that you're making it happen? or what My lifestyle, you, sexual, you, my sexuality, maybe. A homosexual. Uh, that's bullshit, because I've seen bisexual spirits, and they ain't going no fucking where in hell. They're still part of the light. I've seen that bullshit. That's I haven't communicated with it. I mean, Some that's dude, the only thing I can think there of. There was this dude in a coma. I already got a story on this, my YouTube. My other YouTube. But it's connected to the Zoom. Hey, I, I met this black chick just walking down the street and she was going to the hospital. And I'm like, hey, bitch, get in my ride, get in my car. You know you need to ride. I was psychically juiced, so I didn't give a fuck what right. anyone thinks. I'm just going to try it out on her. And she and I'm like, what's your choice? And she's like, I'm a Libra. And I would have said no, but I'm really like in a hurry to get to the hospital. I'm like, yeah, typical fucking Libra. No, I'm a stuck up bitch. I don't know. And then, um, so she gets in and I'm like, Okay, well, when we get to the hospital, I'm going to try to cycle read you um, in the parking lot because I'm really talkative. And if we go in the hospital, I'll be like, what's your time? What's your time? And I did not have to be like distracted by everything and talk too much. So we did that. And like, right when we got out of the car, I was like, is your friend in the hospital named Daniel? And she's like, H yeah, how do you know? Because he's standing right in front of me right now. And he's white. And he's telling me he's leaving. He's got a red truck. He, he's got a keychain with the name Lynn on it in silver letters. And then he has a circle keychain that's white with a Christmas tree on it. How many fucking people have that? And she was like saying, yes, yes, he does. And he's blah, blah. And that was so cool and amazing. And he's, apparently he's in the fucking hospital on a camera, bitch. And like, uh, uh, I explained what his mom looks like. And she's texting back and forth to his mom. And his mom saying, he just died at so-and-so this time. So he's dead right now. He can reach out to the whole fucking world. But he got me because I was paying attention and I got... 
up on her and asked her if she wanted a motherfucking ride. Hello. Hello. So, get it, bitch. And he was bisexual.com, and he ain't going to hell. He's in the light. Y'all can all get mad about it all you want. It's all nature. All the fucking animals and nature are going to go to hell, because they all have these sad fucking souls, too, because I've seen spirits of people's pets, and they even told me they were about like astrology signs, and it got confirmed by the retarded living people that you can pinch on Earth, okay? <laughs> Thank right. you. So, and there's reincarnation for them, too, like because... That keep going with your experience. No, no, no. Oh, no, that was it. Oh, really? Yeah. So, you were supposed to have the fear of God. And what, what, okay. what about the heavenly bar? Beautiful, you said? Beautiful. Uh, like there the are line. streets of gold. What? And, yeah. Why? Why does everyone say that? There's a big, there's a wall with nothing. Gold is so ugly. Gold. Who cares? Follow the other road. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't care. It'd probably be pretty. So what? I like gold mermaids looking things, but I don't even, I've never seen a mermaid. I've never, I've never seen, seen a unicorn. I don't believe in zebras. <laughs> I just believe in unicorns. But, <laughs> I mean, I, I already seen things that I know that are real that I never thought was like whatever. So like the seraphim well, beings. And, anyways. I might need to start heading that. <clears throat> Hey, I got a story for you. Fro, come and get me tomorrow. Okay. I told my sisters what they were having. Like, oh, kids, the, yeah, I do that too with the people too. But I'm like a comp competitive person. When I have a dream, yes, like it. it's all black and it's mm -hmm. fish. Whatever fish that comes to my dream, it could be like <laughs> a green fish or a blue fish, it don't matter. But it usually tells me what they're having. And I told all four of my sisters they're having girls. I do it when I'm awake. <laughs> <laughs> but that's super cool too. So that's part of it, and maybe there'll be more if it comes to pass. More.